everyone, welcome to Filmora MVP YouTube channel. Here, we teach you the latest editing tips, camera tricks, and filmmaking techniques. In this video, we're going to show you how to make a thumbnail on Filmora 10 for YouTube super fast and totally free. Yes, you heard it right. You don't need to pay a penny to buy any software. So keep watching this video till the end. Before we start, make sure to subscribe to the channel and don't forget to hit the bell icon. According to the YouTube Creator Academy, 90% of YouTube videos that perform well have a custom thumbnail. It shows the importance and benefits of having a custom thumbnail for YouTube videos. To get started, make sure that the Filmora 10 video editor is downloaded and installed on your computer. We have attached a link in the description below from where you can easily download and install it. Let's get started. Before getting started, let's make sure to select the 16 by 9 aspect ratio to make it a perfect fit for YouTube. If you are already in the editing interface, you can click here to check the aspect ratio. Filmora 10.5 has a new feature, AI Portrait, which helps you to remove your background easily without green screen or any effort to cut out the background pixel by pixel. To make the thumbnail for YouTube video, import the background for your thumbnail or we can also choose from the sample colors of Filmora. For my thumbnail, I'm going to use this gradient 2 background and place it into the timeline. Since we're making a thumbnail for a YouTube video, we need to choose the character from my video. To do that, we can either choose a selected pic or simply take a snapshot from the video by clicking here. Now we need to remove the background of the snapshot. Go to the effects, click on AI Portrait, Select the human segmentation and drag it onto the snapshot. It will ask you to purchase it, but we will show you how to use it without buying it. We will go with try it for now. We have successfully removed the background of our snapshot. Let's add the human border effect. Drag and drop it onto a snapshot to apply it. It looks nice, but it does not look good in this position. Let us make it smaller and move it to the bottom left of the video. It is almost complete, but it can be enhanced using titles and stickers. Go to the titles. There are several title categories, but the titles will perfectly fit the thumbnail. Click on the titles. The title 16 can look good on our thumbnail. Drag and drop it above the footage. Make it a bit smaller and place it in the upper right corner of the screen. Perfect. Our thumbnail is ready but something is still missing. Let's fill the empty spaces of the screen with stickers. Go to the elements, select Journey, and drag the Element Travel 3 and drop it above the footage and place it on the lower corner and we're good to go. Our thumbnail is ready. Now let's export this thumbnail. To do that, click on the small snapshot button below the preview section. It's done. The screenshot is saved in Filmora's directory. You can easily access the directory by clicking on the media, then project media. Here you will find all the snapshots. Right click on any snapshot and select reveal in explorer. It will open the folder that contains all the snapshots. So now you have learned how to make a thumbnail for YouTube using Filmora 10. Try it yourself and let us know about the outcomes in the comment section below. We would love to read about your experience. Thumbs up if you like this video and make sure to subscribe to the channel for more helpful tips and tricks about Filmora 10. Hope to see you in our next video. Till then, bye!